Hello, brothers and sisters. So just quickly touching on this one thing again. The mark of the beast we've discussed on this channel many times. And I've told you we see everything in place right now for it to be implemented. The final mark of the beast, whether that be the infusion of Nephilim DNA into the final implantation chip, that will only be ready halfway into the tribulation. When he declares exactly who he is and what he is and demands worship, you will have to take that mark as a sign of allegiance. Revelation 20 verse 4 to 6 speaks to can you take it and still be saved? Then I saw thrones and seated on them were those to whom the authority to judge was committed. Also, I saw the souls of those who had been beheaded for the testimony of Jesus and for the word of God and those who had not worshipped the beast or its image and had not received its mark on their foreheads or their hands. They came to life and reigned with Christ for a thousand years. The rest of the dead did not come to life until the thousand years were ended. This is the first resurrection. Blessed and holy is the one who shares in the first resurrection. Over such the second death has no power. But they will be priests of God and of Christ and they will reign with him for a thousand years. Those who had been beheaded for the testimony of Jesus, for the word of God, and those who had not worshipped the beast or its image and had not received its mark on their foreheads or their hands. I can give you more and more scriptures. You cannot take the mark and still be saved. I am convinced that when they give you that mark, there will be a switch flipped in you. You will be cut off and finished and done. That is why people will be beheaded for their testimony for Jesus Christ and the word of God and standing for truth and refusing to take the mark. Because that mark will be allegiance to the beast and Satan. And you will have picked your side for eternity. So no, you cannot take the mark of the beast and come out the other side. Those who come out of the tribulation are those who stood against it. Those who woke up after we were raptured. They are the ones that will be saved through the tribulation, along with that remnant of the Jews. Taking the mark and being saved after is a non-starter if you're reading scripture correctly. God bless. Have a great day. I hope that helps. Shalom.